Use an existing report. Use an existing report to include its results in a letter, an email, or another report. This saves you work because you avoid rebuilding filters. As an example, you want to send an email to all the constituents who gave last year. You have an existing report that shows these constituents. Add a filter. To find the existing report, you need to know what type of data that report is based on. This email is filtering for transactions. If you want to find an existing transaction report, click Is in a transaction report. Select the report you want. Click View Filters to review the filters. If you click OK, the report and email are linked. Any changes to the report will affect the email. To make the email independent of the report, click Copy Filters instead. This copies the current report filters to your email. Future changes to the report will not affect the email. For now, click OK. The existing report is added to your filters. Now look at how you find and use an existing report that is based on a different type of data. Here is your email that is based on transactions. You want to find an existing interaction report. Since interactions belong to constituents, you look for constituents who have an interaction report. To start, click Add Filter. Click Constituent. Now you look for the interaction report. Click Add Filter and Has Interactions. You want to find specific interactions that are included in a report, so click Specific Interactions. Click Add Filter. Click Is in an Interaction Report. Select the report you want. Notice again the path you took. From a transaction email, you added constituent filters and looked for the interaction report. Click OK to add the existing report to your filters. Continue adding other filters as you need.